What is up peeps, this is your host Supersite and welcome back to another video. So today's video we're going to be making a computer worth 1000 US dollars. Now note that only includes the CPU, GPU, SSD, HDD and RAM. That does not include the motherboard, that does not include the power supply and that does not include the case or antivirus and this monitor and stuff like that so be aware of that second thing to note I'm no computer expert I'm doing this for fun this is the design that I would make if I was making one for myself but there's a lot of people that know a lot more stuff about computers than I do so yes without further ado let's get into it so I'll get rid of myself click okay there we go now we go into do, 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 this one right here okay there we go so we're gonna start building one so we're gonna do a GPU exclusive one meaning it doesn't have the GPU because GPU is an essential for a computer to run and then we're going to do one that has all all five of... Oh, where's that six things? Oh, I know the motherboard. No, we're not doing the motherboard. Okay, there we go. So, CPU. Now, let's start it off with a 3900X because this one here is solid and a thousand US dollar budget is very solid also. Okay, there we go. So, I've already decided on that. In fact, I'm just going to... Oh, wait. No, no. For this one, we need an Intel one. Okay. Okay, let's go and we'll come down here to show all prices. Boom. And we're going to go value. Boom. And so that one there. But we can afford to make the leap to this one here. Ooh, that, that there, that's looking very nice. Ooh, I reckon. And it's about the same value. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to go for that. That is, that is a massive increase. This is like getting incredibly solid right now. Okay, there we go. GPU. Okay, this is going to take a huge amount of the budget, just these two things alone. Bam. We only have 290 left for all three of the other things. But again, with the HD... Yeah, we'll probably go with the $88 one, which is always a good good option. Show all prices. And you can download it as CVC, which is cool. Bam. Like this. $88. This one here, just such a good mid-range one. Like, 4 terabytes is solid, more than most people have. And it's just really not that expensive. And, I mean, we can jump up and get, like, a 6 terabyte one if we need, but 4 terabytes, that suits me just fine. Well, there we go. I know it suits most people just fine. Okay, there we go. Bam. There we go. Kachow. Okay, there, now 200. Someone has this one person out there. Shout out to that one person. That one person. There we go. This person here one month ago. Lots of them are pretty recent, actually, that has. They have this with this graphics card and that one right there. See, they have... Oh, wait, no, no. That makes... That one... Yeah, I'm sure that would be a good one. Yeah. Okay, they, oh, they got four times RAM. Okay, there we go. Bam. So, that that is that. Looking good. Okay, now we have $200. $200 is reasonable amount. Okay, there we go. And the SSD, we know which one we're going to get, don't we? There we go. Oh, we'll just go to value. You don't need to show prices. There we go. This one. Oh, one of the prices must be stale. Uh, yeah. The, okay, there we go. So, we'll go that, that one right there. Copy. And we'll go. That is under... Oh, wait. Oh, we still have three things left to get. Do we? No, no, two things. There we go. Bam, like that. There we go. And then we have... 130. I know which one we're going to get. Okay, there we go. We come over to RAM. There we go, and we go to value, and, um, wait, that one, that one, that one there, yeah, yeah, I think the other one, the prices, show prices, bam, like that there, yeah, okay, there, oh, that's going up slightly, but there we go, that there, it might be a little bit over, but we'll count that as a thousand dollars, okay, there we go, so, ram, and then we'll come over here, and we'll go like that, that, there we go, and, ka -chow! right there, that is an absolute unit of a computer right there on the left. There we go. I, yeah, it is. It is that. It's is that less than one percent. One point one percent. Wait. Yeah. No. Uh. Yeah. One point one percent difference in that. It's sort of they do fluctuate. Like I think the other day wasn't that like one hundred and thirty or whatnot. So it's yeah around about that. I thought it was one hundred and thirty. Maybe not. But yeah, approximately a thousand dollars right there. Again, I could have got and rather than upgrading the RAM, I could have got better. You know. SSD and HDD or whatnot, but that right there is such a solid build. That's such a solid build. Okay, now we're going to go for one that, uh, so this time, because last time what I did, because I mean, they're both good options, either, like, I can, like, just go for an ultra good CPU and sort of this kind of level of these things, or I can sort of get, like, a pretty solid CPU and get really good of these three things. I reckon I'm going to go for the very, very solid CPU. Okay, there we go. So we're going to go show all prices. Bam. And then we're going to... We're just going to go like that. Bam. There we go. Yeah, most... I don't know why it goes up to 3,000 or whatnot. Anyway. 
this one right here. This one right here? Yep, this one right here. We're going to go with this one right here. An absolute solid unit right there. Boom. And we're going to go over here. You see, like, I'm not even comparing them because I actually have started to get to sort of know them. Like this one versus... Oops, not that. There we go. This one. Oops. This one versus this one here. There we go. Both very similar. It's the the six. See, like virtually, like no difference for these things. But it's this this thing here. Bam, thirty percent faster. And it's for that reason alone that we are going to be going with this one right here. Okay, CPU. Oh, this is alternative one. Bam, like this. And it's the not the KF one. That one there. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And it was some really bad benchmarks right there. Hmm. Okay. There, anyway, that's that one. Okay, that's half, there's literally half the budget. Literally, oh, no, but then 290 of that is freed up that we don't need to spend on that. Hmm. So, we can't... Well, can we? 290. Was that... Oh, yeah, no, 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 no. We can get... We can get better of these things anyway. Oh, oh my goodness. Okay, there we go. Let's copy all these over. That one. That one. And that one. Oh, someone had it without that one. There we go, like that. Okay, so... And that's with... $185 left to spare. That's insane. Okay, there we go. What are we going to upgrade? I reckon the SSD, we might as well upgrade. The SSD and show prices. Bam. Okay, so we're currently at this level here. And so we would only want to get... Now, that one's too expensive. Wait, so how much should we... Uh, so we could go up to $300. Uh, no, that's like 250. Okay, we'll cap it at 250. Just get those other options, whether they're better or worse. It doesn't matter. We can't afford them. So, bam, they're gone. Okay, there we go. So, and we're already up to like here. So, there's only. These are the only ones we'd consider that we could go to. Hmm, the one of these ones here. This one here is the one I've got for myself, personally. I prefer that one over that one. And then you could go for. See, these ones here are cheaper. That one's cheap. like that one there. That one, that one looks like a good one. Let's try this versus this. Okay, there we go. Bam. Okay, but yeah, this one, yeah, fifty nine percent faster for sixty dollars. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go, go, gonna go with the rocket one. Okay. Boom. So the rocket. Here we go. This one right here, very good option. Okay, copy that. Bam, bam, and we'll go to SSD. There we go, and we'll move. Oh no, but again, that is not all that because that's some of that boom and then we have wait what wait really oh no there's a two terabyte one okay that, 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 I was like what in the world okay there we go bam there we go oh so only 50 more dollars 50 more dollars hmm oh no and that's uh, technically that's minus 11 48 more dollars 48 more dollars 48 more dollars so it will take 50 dollars eh, 130 let's have a look at these you go bam, and then we go to value. Okay, 100, 125. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, let's just have a look. Uh, that's only one, oh no, that's only one extra terabyte. So it's not. So if we say five, there we go. Mm, capacity has to be 500. Bam. These are our options. And then if we went to Oh, yeah, and it has to be under, like, 100 and... Like that. Bam. That doesn't leave us with many options. And reduce that further. Like, 50. Bam. Okay, there we go. That's our options right there. Not many options. Well, there's an 8 terabyte one. Wow. For 150. Who would have thought? Yeah, I reckon that one. Oh, 150. I don't know if we can... I don't think we can afford that. We can just have a look. Okay, and we go to HDD. Bam, 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 like that, and ciao. Oh, three dollars extra, extra. Hmm. Just keep pushing the boundaries, don't we? Okay, there we go. So that's eight terabyte, six terabyte. Oh yeah, that one there, that one there. There we go. Just so we don't, there we go. Push the boundaries, so that's still within within a fair range. Okay, there we go. So sometimes we go over, sometimes we go a little bit under. There we go. Bam, like that. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So there we have two options. Actually, they're pretty quickly. So two options. So the one on the left has a GPU, so it's good for gaming and that. The one on the right does not have a GPU. Although, with, mind you, that said, with, a, with, a, with something like that, I mean, it wouldn't be terrible for gaming. Like, I mean, I still reckon it would be alright. But yeah, as in, because that, that's solid as... There we go. But this here would just be... I personally would definitely go with this side over this side here. That said, like, that is a nice, 
Yeah, two tier body extra. Yeah, I bet probably my favorite thing would just be that that upgrade. To be honest, that right that, there. That, yeah. But yeah, if I had the choice, I'd definitely go with the one on the left. Even though I don't do PC gaming really, although I did do Age of Empires yesterday, and I did some more today, about an hour and a half, which was fun in that. But yeah, I don't need <laughs> a nuclear submarine to to for the games I play and that. But yeah, that there is a solid, absolute unit of an option for one thousand US dollars. Again, you do need the motherboard and the power supply and everything else. But for those five parts. That that's a really good option. I mean that that's so good. That right there is so 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 good. Like that's better than it's just so good. Like it's, it's such a good computer. Like that there. And that would be better than what the vast majority of people in the world have. Like way way better than most people have. Like I my computer is better than what most people have. And and I would say this one this one's probably twice as good and twice as fast as my one. Like it's got double the RAM. It's got four times the amount of HDD space. SSD is about the same. Yeah, it's the same. This one will be faster, though. Maybe even twice as fast. Not sure. Uh, GPU, that would be probably twice... No, that'd probably be more than twice as fast as mine. And CPU would be more than twice as fast as mine as well. So this year's... This year, 1,000 US dollars is twice as fast as my one is. And my one's really good. Like, I can stream 60 frames per second via a stream. It works wonderfully in that. And this is double that. And my one's already... I'd say probably my computer's in the top 10% of computers in the world. Maybe even the top 5%, probably. I'm not sure. Ah, uh, maybe. Uh, but yeah, it's... Yeah, but if you include, like, every single computer, including all the ones on Windows XP and Windows Vista and Windows 8 and all that, with the one on the left, like, that would just be... That would be insane. Like, that... That I reckon that one... I don't know. Uh, bold call. Bold call. I'm going to say that one there would still be working fine if you bought it now in 2030. So it's a bold call, I know. I know. But I, I honestly think it would. As long as the parts didn't literally wear out and just break down. Like, that there... I, I, well, that's... I don't know. I assume that... in. 10 years time that would be of use for the average person like that would still work fine but who knows that it might be exponential in the amount of use but if they do it too quickly people won't be able to afford to keep up like if they make it all these new cool features you need you need ultra high amounts you know it will just push most people out because like yeah it would just be way too expensive like if you have to like if yeah have to buy it like, i mean this year is certainly reasonable in price, you know, like, good value stuff for what it is, like, that's what I'm trying to do, I'm trying to select the stuff that's ultra high quality for, like, as good value as you can possibly get around that price, price tag and that, so, but yeah, I don't know, in 10 years time, will a computer like that still be valid? Like, I reckon it would, but who knows, who knows, I mean, I just think it kind of has to be, because in the sense that, like, yes, there could be exponential things they do, which require more and more and more computer power than that, but if they do it too fast, it just, they won't be able to, most people won't be able to do it, like, most people won't be able to keep up, if they make it like, oh, by the way, in order to do this, you have to need this much uh, computer power, and like, 90 plus percent of the population doesn't have that, unless it's a really profitable thing that, that, that they can just tap into that top 10 percent, you know, it's, it's not going to really work, because they need to keep everything that the majority can do it in that, and for that reason, I think that will slow down, I mean, they're, they're releasing stuff that most people can't even use at the moment, but as in, they don't really, they release it with the knowledge most people can't use it in that, like ray tracing and that, which only certain graphics cards have, and only certain computers have graphics cards and that, so that's like really advanced and really sort of up there in that, you know, but, and which which gamers can start taking advantage of if they have those certain graphics cards and that, but they can't move too quickly in the sense that most people won't be able to use the new things they do, and if most people can't even use them, they can't make that much money if the vast majority of the customer base can't even do it, but yeah, anyway, there we go, this year I reckon it would just be absolutely awesome, like this year, this year is kind of it's actually getting more and more similar to what I'm actually getting. Like, uh, that's the CPU I got. I effectively got this. It just, in, in like a four-pack. It, well, it was actually rip jaws and that. But effectively, I got that. I got that, you know. And the this I got this one here, which for the, if we'd have a little bit more upgrade, we'll upgrade. The graphics card was actually about similar, similar to this one right here. So this here is actually very similar, with the exception of the HDD, which I got the 12 terabyte one for the sake of recording. But if it wasn't for that, I wouldn't have, I'd, I'd wouldn't get a 12 one, probably like four or six or whatnot would be fine. But yeah, this here, like, yeah, this is very similar to the actual one that I got. Not exactly, like, there's a, you know, yeah, like, but yeah, this is very similar to the one I got, because I, it's, it's, it's sort of, post this point, the value starts to go down, like, I think this year, there's like, sort of the, the, the 
brilliant, wonderful point about a thousand US dollars is about, and not for the sake just because it's all a thousand, that's like a nice number, like it is a nice number, but as in, it's at the point where you get ultra good stuff, but not at the price of price. <laughs> so, like, as in, uh, up until this point, every upgrade still keeps adding on incredible value. You don't lose much value with these upgrades. These are still very good value things in that. You know, up until about 1000 give or take, you know, like, you know, give or take maybe $300. I know that's a big range, but as in, you know, around that 1000 mark, up to sort of $1,300 US dollars, down to sort of $700 US dollars, you know, it, around that point, you know, it's, it's ultra good value. For example, there's like there's like that because these here is about the best value CPU you can get that's really good quality but not too expensive same with GPU it's sort of like really good quality and not too expensive the ones above it start to get really really costly in that you know and, and don't it's not for ex it's not worth it in a sense like you might for example get 10% better increase in that but it might be 30% price increase in that so it starts to not pass this point it's diminishing returns in that up and it's kind of weird because it's almost like a curve because if you go too low down at sort of 500 us dollars or 600 us dollars it's it's not really good enough and so it's not really worth it in a sense so it's it's so it's sort of bad too low and and bad if you go too high like up into the sort of like the 2000 us dollar range in that so you know so this, this is sort of like the sweet spot where you get the perfect value you get like the maximum value you know in terms of like you get the the top of the range parts that are still good value but then post this point, th there's not really any such parts. It's just, yeah, the better parts, but they're insanely more expensive. It's it's not, in my opinion, worth the upgrade in that. You know, and then the... I mean, there is the Ryzen 9 3950, but that's still not as good value. It's still reasonable, but it's still getting, getting out sort of, yeah. Uh, but yeah, all of these parts are sort of like really good like that ssd is brilliant i mean you can upgrade this one like 130 dollars to this one here at which point i definitely wouldn't go past that one really uh, for the average user in that hdd is just real cheap anyway in that and this ram is sort of the best value in that that one that you can't really get better like i mean that's just brilliant like that's just as good as it comes and it's not actually that cheap i mean they're expensive in that consider as a relative percentage of the parts you know the cpu and the gpu are normally very very expensive this here is just such a wonderful wonderful there we go. i'll show you if you go to gpus there we go like this and we'll go we'll base it on no we're gonna do it on average benchmark we're gonna show there we go. All right, there we go. Now these ones don't have prices, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to move it in so it just gets rid of these. Bam, like this. So where are we at? Where are we at? So like some of the ones we've used in the past, like this one here, you can see because yeah, like that one there. Boom is is like nice value in there. And then I don't, I don't even know where we've. Uh, did we go to? No, we didn't go to that one. That was the 230 one in that. You know, I think we went the 161 and we leapt up to the 230 in that. And then there was. Then there's, there we go, because the one I got, I got this one right here, actually. This is the one I got. So, wait, no, no, was it? No, 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 it's not. I didn't get that one. Oh, I can't remember what one I got. Oh, no, I think the, oh, no, because it's, oh, no, no, maybe it is that one. I think it's because it's, it's in US dollars. That's why it's throwing me in that. But, yeah, so if we come up here, there we go. Uh, so, as you can see here, like this here. 1% more performance for $341. Now, that's not a completely valid comparison that, but it's, it's just not really. And you can see so this here is the value category, which I think divides like this by price or whatnot. So this one here, this one here is the one I, I was actually going to get. This was the one I wouldn't, I would didn't really consider anything above that because it's just not worth it. Like eight, you know, that eight points more for like from that to that is like $200 more. So I was going to get this one, but it wasn't in stock for that price in, at, at Amazon, so I didn't get that one and that, but this one here, this one here is an incredibly good one, uh, so with it, yeah, with it, that one's sort of a mid-range kind of exception in that, but see, as you can see, 63 value in that, it's, it's, you know, that one's really good value, that one there is not good value, because, like, it's, it's worse than this one, but it costs, like, a grand more in that, but see, the, the red range is sort of the range I would not wander into, really, because it's just, and, and it's sort of, you can tell, because these go yellow and, and red, whereas these sort of, this is sort of the point where, I'd, and I'm not just doing it based on color, like as in it actually is the point where I'd stop so I wouldn't really go I wouldn't go past this point where the value diminishes below sort of 50% really because 
like, and these these sort of take hard hits down to 42% in that, which I mean that one there is still all right, but it's it's taken a hit of like 10% for the value. Or, I'm not sure if that's percent or what, but uh, yeah. So this one here, as you can see, such a good option, like 106 for 400 dollars. But for example, you go, you jump to this one here, six more points. But like over 400, more than twice is, is the price in that. And I'm just like, mm, no, no. So that's this, this here is sort of my line. I'm drawing a line in the sand and it's that line right there. Not because of the color, just because like at the actual value below 50%, it just diminishes. And likewise, I wouldn't get stuff down here that's, that's like under the the 50% value either, approximately, roundabouts 50%, but up until this point here, I'd stop, this, I'd, I'd stop at this line, and that's literally the line which I'm, I'm going to buy in, see, that's the one that we put in the computer right there, that one there would be too expensive to put in that $1,000 model, but that one there is really good value, 63 value, and it's about as good as you can get, but past that point, I just think the value's not worth it, in my opinion, so yeah, that's, that's that, and then for the CPU, if we go to, there we go, like this, and we go to average bench. Oh wait, CPU, CPU, CPU. Oh no, no. If if we're sorting by the 64, bam, like this, and then bam, like that. There we go. So we are going for this one right here, uh, which the value-wise 80 in that. And then see, like these ones here have much less value, but they're still. There we go, all right. But anyway, this here, see, that sort of kind of sticks out. Like, as in these ones are all value, but yeah. This one's harder to tell in that. But yeah, that one there sort of, that one there, as, as I mentioned, is sort of the last one on the way, where it's kind of all, it's all right. It's all right. It's it's 10% less value in that or whatnot, but it's still reasonable. But these ones here are just not, they're just not cutting it for me. They're just not cutting it. It's just, the upgrade is just not, not worth it, in my opinion. And yeah. But anyway, that there, that there is, although no, that's not basing it on that though, it's not basing it on this one here, it's basing it on the center one. But anyway, that there is the, the video, I hope you guys enjoyed it. So that's, on the left is the one I recommend you get if you're going to have a GPU, and on the right is the one I'd recommend you get if you're going to get a, a GPU exclusive model. So in the future, we'll keep upgrading that, now I'm going to probably not upgrade the CPU or the GPU and I'll just keep upgrading these parts like really nicely like that one will sort of jump up to this not quite next one and then this one will slowly upgrade it and whatnot but yeah anyway hope you guys enjoyed let me know in the comments what you think and what model you would have got what parts you would change to what I got as always remember I am no expert at this matter so yeah take what I say with a grain of salt but anyway I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you next time goodbye for now Ciao.